Some troubling news in the high country. Colorado Parks and Wildlife has found another body of water infested with zebra mussels, this time in Eagle County. The invasive species was first found on the western slope. Your report in the mountain, Spencer Wilson, shows us just how impactful this infestation could be and how we can work to stop it. If you're trying to get out on the water in Colorado and you have to go through a boat inspection or you're catching it on the way out, it might feel tedious and like a waste of time. But this very particular checkpoint might be the only thing from stopping Colorado from having an infestation that we will not be able to get rid of. It's a simple enough idea. Check any watercraft before they go in and when they come out to stop the spread. We're looking for any water in the boat, any plant material, any animals. The boat just needs to be clean, drained and dry. Those rules should be enough, but the zebra mussels are still making their way east across the state. All eyes are now on stopping this before it gets out of hand. But I think right now is a moment in Colorado's history with water that is going to be defining how we handle this and whether we are reaching out to each other to find solutions together that are going to move us forward in the long term instead of just being reactive and finding like short term fixes. Because the alternative is expensive fixes to water infrastructure, lower flows and waterways and filtered water, which sounds good, but is not. It takes nutrients out of the water that our local wildlife need, as well as raising the temperature of the water itself, which can kill our fish. <laughs> Tiffany Hayes knows all of this and is doing her part with her paddleboard. I wipe mine down really good after each use with a towel. And at that time, I ex inspect that and I inspect all the different parts just to make sure there's not something on there that shouldn't be there. Which is the kind of person we all need to be if we want to catch this before every body of water in Colorado is suddenly dealing with the sharp, destructive, multiplying invasive species. No, we can't give up. That is, it's not possible. We, we don't have that option. Because our water won't be the only thing out of luck. It's about our Coloradans too. My livelihood depends on it, so yeah. At the Frisco Marina, Spencer Wilson covering Colorado first. And if you're interested in learning more about zebra mussels in Colorado, the Colorado River District is doing a free webinar soon. You can check out the details on our website, cbscolorado.com.